AJ Styles vs. Rusev. Alexis Corio here, back with some more wrestling talk content on the Alexis Corio brand YouTube channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any wrestling talk content in the future. And we are in the final gear of Extreme Rules, build up Extreme Rules hype, Extreme Rules preview and predictions. And it's time for some of the most attractive, some of the most exciting matches that we are going to see this Sunday at Extreme Rules. One of which is the match for the WWE Championship. The phenomenal one, AJ Styles, faces off against Rusev. It's for the title and, you know, being logical and having a little bit of common sense, this match, because it's for the title, should close out the show. It should main event Extreme Rules, but it most likely will not. Because I have a feeling Roman Reigns versus Bobby Lashley is the match that will close out the show. With back to this match right here for the WWE title. Will we have the most glorious Rusev Day in history this Sunday at Extreme Rules with the Machka Kick Warrior becoming for the first time in his career WWE Champion. And unfortunately for all you Rusev fans, including myself, I do appreciate what Rusev does and I love it when the crowds in the arenas chant Rusev Day. Unfortunately, I think AJ Styles is not slowing down in his title reign. I think he has months and months and months to go as WWE Champion, not only because of the rumors, not only because of the dirt sheets who are, you know, reporting this, the fact that AJ Styles versus Samoa Joe is being advertised for a SummerSlam in some in Brooklyn, if I'm not mistaken. But I also believe that there is really right now on SmackDown nobody better than AJ Styles to carry that WWE title. And there is nobody that the WWE has positioned in a way that they can take the title off of the phenomenal one. And unfortunately, this this build up to this match at Extreme Rules, Styles versus Rusev, has been kind of weak. Yes, uh, Rusev won the gauntlet match and became number one contender. And then there wasn't a lot of heat. There wasn't a lot of, uh, of back and forth. There wasn't a lot of tension between Styles and Rusev until this very last week of SmackDown Live, I think, when. AJ Styles was facing Nakamura. Uh, apparently, Styles uh, hit Aiden English uh, accidentally. And then Rusev went in for the interference, cost AJ Styles the match, turned into a tag team match. And if I remember correctly, Rusev won that. Rusev and Nakamura won that tag team match over Hardy and AJ Styles. So, sim so really, not a lot to say about this match other than the fact that that AJ Styles is the babyface, he's the champion, he's a favorite to win this match. It's going to be interesting to see how the crowd reacts during this match, simply because Rusev Day is beloved by tons of fans, by millions of fans. I will no doubt guarantee you that, you know, the arena is going to be filling up with Rusev Day chants all throughout this match. And at the end of the day, I think everyone's going to go home happy, whether it be AJ Styles retaining the title over Rusev, or Rusev making history and becoming champion over AJ Styles. These are two superstars that are fan favorites and that are beloved by the IWC, so I really don't see a lot of trouble going on for this match as it pertains to WWE. Now, who do I think wins? Kind of already said it throughout the video. AJ Styles retains the title simply because he is the absolute best. He is phenomenal. And he built SmackDown Live. You know, those are my thoughts. I think AJ Styles retains. I would certainly be okay with Rusev winning. It'd be a surprise, but I'd be okay with it with Rusev becoming WWE Champion. Leave your thoughts below. Do you think AJ Styles' reign should continue on for months and months and months uh, in the future? Or do you think it's time for Rusev Day to become WWE Champion Rusev Day? Leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That's it for me.
Till next time.